love and ready to swap and box you kick and conk you anytime you fuck up <laughs> What kind of dream is this? Hope. What kind of dream is this?
How, how's my wife? Your wife? Yes. Um, Let's talk in my office. In your office? There won't be any point. You can tell me. How, how are they doing? Um, okay. Let's have a city and talk. Come. As a matter of fact, your wife is in a perfect state. Thank God. And my baby? Um, sorry we lost him. You, 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 you what? It's a pity. Oh, that is not joke with me. What are you telling me? You, you, you. Calm down. Take uh, it, okay? No, doctor, you cannot tell me this. No! Where is my baby? Your baby is at the dressing room. What of my husband? Your husband is at the reception. Should I go and call him? Yes. Okay, I'll do that for you, okay? God has reason for every of our circumstances, okay? Put yourself together and stop shedding further tears. He will bring the one that will stay. After nine months. After nine months, oh, after nine see. months, oh God, why? Come see, come see, it's okay. Why? God knows why it happened like that. You need to be thankful to God. This is painful. This is so painful. But you can't kill yourself. You can't just do that. Hi. Modestus! <laughs> my wow. man, Queen! In years! How are you doing? Meet my wife. My wife, Queen. Hey, how are you? I'm fine. My son. Okay. Wow. Tell me my daughter. Tell your kids. Yes. The lovely family you have. Uh, and your wife? Uh, she's fine. She just stepped in to pick something. I, I, I'm waiting for her. She will leave uh, in a bit. Okay. All right. Uh, yeah, I still have your contact. We'll, we'll keep in touch. All right. All right. All right. Wow. Good to see you. Thank you. <laughs> All right. Take care. Bye. Bye. more than 20 wives and I don't want that for myself. That is why I have to be sure. It is either she has a child already for me or she's pregnant with one.
I'm asking you, what were you thinking? Because you saw a man with his children. That's why you left your wife and came back to this place. Hey! Can only go say go there? Can only Zulu go be a Ghana joke? You better go back and bring her back. In our living room, go and bring your wife back. Why did you just disappear like that? Uh, what happened? It's okay. Don't worry, I will explain later. Hmm? Let me tell you, if I was a digger, you don't know your husband again. I'm not going to say this. I'm not going to say this. I'm not going to say this. What happened? What happened? What is it? Oh. Nightmare. Nightmare. Oh. Nightmare. Nightmare. Uh, what happened in it? Come and give me a big, big hug. Come, all of you. <laughs> okay, okay. I don't want anybody to fight. Eh? I'm going to share this biscuit to all of you. Eh? Don't fight. It will get to everybody. Hmm? Oh, yeah. Take. What you got here? Oh, yeah. Take. Oh, yeah. Take. In short, one for that song. <laughs> oh, yeah. Take. Uh, hey. Take. Oh, yeah, take. Mm. Oh, my baby. <laughs> oh, yeah, take. Okay. Come, 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 come. What are you doing? What do you think that you are doing? Who asked you to give my, my son biscuit? Who asked you to give the children biscuit? Oh, you go, go. Hey, hey! Maybe you were asked to bring children 
That's why I'm shining biscuit to them. The ritualist. Thank God. Thank God. My God is alive. You can give to others. Or are you? That is your brother. He's not my brother. Eh, even if he's not your brother, eh? You're older than him. So allow him play with the tire. Eh? I don't want both of you to fight again. Do you hear me? I don't want to see you fighting. Oh yeah, promise me you will never fight again. Yes. I you promise. promise not to fight again. I promise. And you will keep your promise. Yes. Oh yeah, you take the tire. Both of you run home. Oh! My friend, it's a pleasure to meet you. Same here. So, I was discussing with her concerning your problem. And she told me that she knows where you can go to and your problem will be solved. Hey! God, I thank you. God, I thank you. I know that's no way you forsake me. I know that one. Hi, my sister. God bless you. Bless you too, my dear. Thank you. <laughs> so, when are we going? Um, I would have to make inquiries as regards when we'll see the man. Oh, it's okay. Um, in that case, I'll have to take your number so I can call you tomorrow. It's okay there. And one more thing. Um, the man is a witch doctor, not a pastor. Hmm? So you you support her to, to, to take me to a witch doctor? Tamsi, what are you talking about? What is wrong going to a witch doctor if he has a solution to your problem? Uh-uh. Count me out. Count me out. I will wait for God's time. What's this one? God's time? Yes. God's time. Do you know that this your problem doesn't bother you at all? It bothers me. But that will not make me visit a witch doctor. I can't do that. Mm. Hey! Okay, that's good. Stay there. One day you just come to your house and you find out that your husband has another woman. There is no place we have not gone. There is no hospital we have not visited. We are tired. And the doctors keep telling us the same thing, that we are okay, nothing is wrong with you and your wife. You will conceive. But they keep telling us as well that they don't know when. What kind of trouble is this? Grace. They are telling you that they don't know when because they are not God. There is God in heaven. And he can do all things. Just hold on, okay? Hold on. God's time is the best. Did you say God's time? Yes. Mama, when it's God's time? How many years have we been married? When is God's time? Mama, is it when we are all old and grey or probably dead in our graves? Is that when God's time will come? 
Do you know what we go through? Do you know the ridicule, the shame, the humiliation? Chris! Why are you talking like this? Look up there. There is God in heaven. He is our creator and with him all things are possible. Yes. He will give you and your wife a child. Children at the right time. Wait, oh, you know go. Wait, let me go and get food for you to eat. Mama, I'm, 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 I'm not eating. I'm, I'm not hungry. Food is not my problem now. Why are you walking again? Because Mama, do you know I am dying by the day? Hey. Chris, I understand how you feel. I know all these things. Yes. I know as an Igbo man that you are. You are free. You can marry as many wives as you want. And your house will be filled with children. And you will be happy. Maybe you can as well send Kamsi away. Send him was there. And nobody will kill you. Yes. But let me ask you. Is marriage all about having children? What about peace? What about love? Understanding? Cherishing each other forever? What about all this? What if in the process, your first wife gets pregnant? What are you going to do? Send her away? Or send the other one? Okay. You live with both of them? Will you be able to handle both of them? Tell me. Chris, I still maintain that you hold on to God. Have patience. God is up there. He's watching. I know he will give you children at the right time. Thank you. Have you ever asked God about that which bothers you? What are you talking about? What are you sorry for? Please do not pretend like you don't know what I'm talking about. I'm not a wizard. How would I know what you're talking about? What is it? Your mother asked you to marry another wife. Who told you that? Please don't lie to me. I'm not, don't lie to me. <laughs> I will not take it. Do not lie to me. Mommy, I am not lying to you. You probably misunderstood Mama. She never said a thing like that and she would not. Listen to me. I will never leave you for anybody. It's not possible. You are my life. Okay? We are in this together and we will stay in it till the end, till God answers us. Inugu. I will give you children. Children. 
Not only a child. Children. I know. And I will be with you forever. I will never leave you for anyone. Why Christopher? Yes, Doctor. Congratulations. Your wife is two months pregnant. Serious? Serious? <laughs> Thank you, God! Thank you very much. Thank you. <laughs> wow! I love you so much. God has done it for us. <laughs> I can't wait! <laughs> hey! I, I, hey. Sorry, sorry, please come out, come out, come out, wait. Hey. Hey. Sorry, let's go inside so they can treat it. Um, let's. Uh, no, 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 even if it's for them to clean it at least. Oh, God. Huh? Let's go inside, what sorry. Is this? sorry. What reason did the custom people give you for seizing your goods? My clearing agent said the customs officer told him that the federal government released a list of contraband goods two weeks ago. And my goods fell into that category, unfortunately. Two weeks ago? Eh, but you had imported your goods already now. Eh? You imported them more than two weeks ago, so they should have allowed you to clear your own. I told them that. They said there was a standing order that any such good that fell into that category should be confiscated. I, 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 there was no kind of explanation I did not try to get. I wasn't making any headway. And you know I invested everything I had in this business. I am 
I am wrecked. Hey! Good morning. How are you? Uh, no, I, I I don't want food today. I'm, I'm okay. You are talking that things are very difficult and you are asking me if you should bring the food. Only can be able to eat. Papa! <laughs> well, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. How are you doing now? Fine. Where, where are you going? Well, I came to check one of my friends. You have a friend here? Yes. Yes. Wow. <laughs> wow. How is Kano? My man, Kano is fine. Very, very fine. What of Felix? Have you heard from him? No. Since I've looked at to uh, Kano, I've not heard from him. What of I, you? I lost his number too. I haven't heard from him since then. How is business? Well, things are very rough now. What do you mean? I lost all my goods to the customs. Oh, I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry. It's bad news, bro. It's all right, but we have to keep pushing on. Of course, what man has to survive now? Yes. <laughs> You're only in the streets, okay? Uh, <laughs> well, I came to check one of my friends in insurance line. Oh, okay. What yeah, for? I came with one of the business, but I didn't see him. They say he traveled. Oh, yeah. So, what are you going to do now? Well, I got to check back on him later on. That's it. What, what type of business? Sugar business. Sugar business. Yeah. yeah. I, I hope you still use your number. Why not? Why not? Okay, good. I'll give you a call later tonight. Okay? All, right, all right, all right. Please expect my call. Okay, now. Let me go. Thank you. <laughs> all right, now. Take care. Sugar business. I came here this night because of what you told me on the phone. Because of how you told me this business is lucrative. And my spirit tells me that this business will favor me. That's why I'm here begging you, please. Even the Bible says that all things work together for good to those that believe. Please connect me to this business. I'm begging you in the name of God. I don't have anything left. You know how I spent and lost all my money in that business. If you allow me to hang on with this money a little longer, I will squander it and that wouldn't be nice. That's why I'm begging you. Who? Chris, you are my very good friend. I don't have to beg me this long for me to do what I know I can do for you, freely. But the problem here is that this business, I brought it for someone else who's been doing this business with me. Try and understand me. Okay? Put yourself in his shoes. If you are him, how would you feel? I, 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 I would feel bad. But the thing is, business is business. I believe other opportunities will come. Then you, you can... You can bring him on, please. Chris, I suggest maybe you wait for that opportunity to come so I can fill you in. But you know I cannot wait. If I could wait, I would not be here. You know my situation. You are my last hope. That's why I'm begging you. Be cool. Chris, Chris, don't make it look like man. I'm being tough. Understand? My hands are tied. You know this. This guy is already waiting for this business. Okay? And this is the reason why I'm here. So please, understand me. Talk of the devil. See, he's the one calling. Sugar business. He said it is lucrative and it will cost about 3 million naira. 
Koskwana. That is a huge amount of money. And you don't have it. The money is not even the issue at this point. The point is that he refused to do business with me. Why? He said he, he, he didn't want to betray the former guy he started the business with. But the guy is not around now. Exactly what I told him. I told him this and then he went ahead to tell me that he, he called the guy and he told him he'll be back in two days. Mount more pressure. Hmm? Talk to him. You don't seem to understand how much I have talked to him. I have pleaded, I have... Eh, uh, uh, but try more. Push harder. I'm very sure that he will change his mind and do business with you. You know, go push. <laughs> eh? You need this business. Pico. Just talk more. Eh? Yes, I, I knew if I told you I was coming, you, you might not want me to come. So I decided to just come on my own. I'm sure you're not still talking about some business. I am still talking about it. I'm a dying man. I'm helpless. I'm drowning. I'm begging you to come to my rescue. That is why you are my friend now. Please. Chris. Uh, even my wife wants to talk to you about it. Don't you ever give up on something? I can't give up. I don't have any other hope. You're my lifeline. That is why I'm begging you, please, do this for me and you would have saved a man. It's okay, it's okay. I'm going off, sir. Let me take it off. Do you understand what I'm saying? I'm saying if you give me this opportunity, I will not fail. We are friends. Understand that this woman, I don't have this. I don't have it. Sammy, listen, go now. Go now. Oh God, oh God. What is switched off? What is not available? What is this? Do you do you know the implication of what you're doing to yourself? Eh? Do you know that it will be worse if your BP rises? Please, just come to bed. Come and sleep. I don't want to sleep. In fact, come see, I cannot sleep. How can I sleep? Of course you can sleep. Eh? Oh, just give me one. Oh, give me a chance and I will make you sleep. Come. Come see, if you make me sleep today, what about tomorrow? What about other nights? Sleep this night first. And then what other nights come? You know what to do. Just come to bed. Why are you talking like you don't know how much is involved in this? Three million naira, mom, mad. Why are you talking as if the money, the money is gone already? I thought you trusted Jerry so much, and that was why you invested in the business. I did, but now you have seen how th things have turned out. Eh? The agreement was for two weeks. I was going to get my money. This is the third week. I've been calling his phone for the past one week, and it is switched off. It's in the Lola. See, I strongly believe that nothing is wrong. That money is intact. Eh? So please, just stop worrying yourself and come and sleep. Jerry, you cannot speak. Oh God. Oh God. See, tomorrow morning, I am going to Kano. Yes. Huh? You don't expect me to stay here and, 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 and allow that money go, go, go with the wind. Okay, fine. Come to bed. Hey. It was that not the issue here. All that with your money. Eh? You said you were This one is my phone. Come here the last time. Come here the last time. Come here. Close your eyes and sleep.
Close your eyes and sleep. I'm see, this money is not good. Close your eyes and close your mouth. Sleep. You go more Shh. Shh. Taking this step, eh? it will cost something else. Too, eh? You have not eaten anything since you came back this morning. Okay, just just come and test the food. I do not want to eat. Can you just get me a bottle of beer? I cannot do that. In fact, I will not do it. Uh -uh. What are you trying to do to yourself? Eh? You want to drink on empty stomach, and you know the implication of that. I won't do it. Has it occurred to you that? Jerry has run away with my money. So? Because Jerry ran away with your money, you want to kill yourself. Eh? Listen. You made this money with your own hands. And God will give you the strength to repay the loan. Huh? It's okay. You, you talk like I'm a magician. How do I do this magic? When it is obvious to you that everything has turned upside down. Nothing has turned upside down. I think you should start learning how to let go of things you can't change in life. Meaning? Meaning that there is a solution to every problem. Now what is the solution to this particular problem? The solution is for you to let go of it, put everything into God's hands and you will see the result. Trust me. Hmm? Hi. You know I'm here. 
I think you know why I'm here. I know, sir. Please, you know why I'm here. I know. You have been only for the past eight months. And the enough is enough. I cannot welcome that again. Between now and tomorrow, make sure you pay me. Else, you face my rot. Okay, I'll tell you, I'm not here to tell you what's with you. Pay me between now and tomorrow. Else, you face my rot. That is all. Okay, God damn it, I'm begging. Okay, landlord, see, I. See, I am begging. Okay, landlord. Hey. Can you tell me you don't have the money? And you have sold the goods. Why are you doing this? Are, are you trying to embarrass me here? You give me that money. I'm not living here. You give me that money today. I'm not going anywhere. I said I don't have the money, but I'll, I'll get it soon and then I'll bring it to you. You better come and tell my ogre once he comes back home. I will come. You better come and tell him because I don't want him to kill me. I will come myself and give him the money. So what's the plan? We have to sell off most of these properties. The car. So we can raise money. Pay the landlord. Move into a small apartment. Most likely a one room apartment. And then start anything so that we can pick up again. You're not saying anything. I'm not doing this because I I I I I, I like to sell off my things. I'm doing it because we have to survive. We, We cannot just fold our arms and pretend all is well when we know we are we we we're, we're sinking. You are not saying anything, no. I'm not doing this because I want to sell off everything we have. I'm doing it because we have to find a way to get back on track. My man, hey, what is what's up with you? I'm good, bro. I'm fine. Good, what's going on? I'm fine, I'm good. Okay, yeah. where are you walking to? No way, particular. I'm just taking a walk. What happened to your car? My car is fine, it's good. Walking is part of exercise. I'm just taking a walk. Seriously, yeah. Anyway, there's this group of my friends, they got into town and they want me to hang out with them. So, since you're not doing anything, if you wouldn't mind, can you join me? Come on, Chris, let's go, let's go, let's come on. Hop, in, hop inside the car. Okay.
You've been sitting down here like this since you came back. Eh? Who upset you? Nobody. I've just been thinking about my condition. About your condition? What condition are you talking about? Come see, I saw Martins today. Ah, is it? And he begged me to get into his car that he was going to hang out with some friends. So you went out with them now? I did. And when we got there, we drank and ate. Could you believe he spent approximately 73,000 naira on everything we ate there? Jesus Christ. 73,000 naira on food. I'm telling you. And he did not give me a dime. Did you ask? Hmm? I... I... Thank you. Have you eaten? Mm, yes, I ate biscuit. Biscuit? Anyway, I, I brought yam. Let me prepare so we can eat it. Go. Anama si yuwa masi, anama si kuge 
bring as much as you can. Okay. Before you know it, we get there. Hey! I'm so sorry, sorry, sorry. Sorry now, eh? And dear, we'll, we'll get to the hospital before you know it. We're almost at the road. Eh? Just to pick a taxi. You go, you go. Just breathing, breathing, mm. more breath. Easy, easy, easy. No, 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 Hey, you, what do you want to I do? Want to sit down. You can't sit on the bare floor now. We're almost at the road. Please. Biko. Okay, sorry, sorry. Oh? Biko, Biko. Just endure, yeah. Okay, take a step. Take a step. Hi, let me just sit down. Who can you sit here now? Small, small. Biko. Sorry. Sorry. Are you sure you're okay? I can. Okay, okay. Okay. Eh? Oh, oh give me what? Eh? Baba, come see what you, you are. This is risky, oh. This is risky, oh. Eh? This is risky. You are. Come on, get it. Come on, get it. You don't know. Oh, 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 We agreed on uh, 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 400 naira. You are giving me 50 naira. That, 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 that is all I, I, I can find for now. Just collect it for me, please. I'm, I'm begging you. No, you said you can't pronounce or catch one customer. I know, but this situation is beyond me. You can see my wife's condition. I'm just begging you to take this from me. Please, eh? Put yourself in my shoes. Okay. I'm not putting you on any shoe. Nah, nah, but don't. Give me my money. Nah, please. Now, see. Nah, I'm begging you in God's name. See, my, my wife is in labor, please. 
I'm on my knees, I beg you. you just, just take this one. I. So I was saying thank you. I was saying thank you. Please. That is. That is. That is. What's after you? I'm begging you in God's name. You have to ask me. What's the problem? Yes, uh, my, my, my wife is at the hospital. She's in labor. Uh, and the doctor has insisted he will not touch her until I make some deposits and I do not have any money. And I'm begging you to lend me some money. I'll pay you back, please. Else my wife and child might die. Chris, I don't have money to give to you. I need to speak. Do not tell me this. If you don't help me, my wife will die, my child will die. I am begging you in God's name to assist me. I beg you, please. Yes, that's okay, but even here, and right inside my house, I don't have money to learn or to give to you. Since you are my friend, I, I do you anything, any amount whatsoever. Let it be that there is something I take there. I'm I, begging. I'm sorry, Chris. I don't have to give to you. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Thank you. Oh, my God. Pregnanted your wife first month, second month, third month, and till the ninth month, you can't even save up ten thousand naira to take care of her. Nah, man, some 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 men are tomorrow, man. man. Forget your peace. I am begging you in God's name. Can you assist me with some money? I don't mind paying back just twenty thousand naira. My wife is in the hospital, and the doctors have refused to attend to accept and make some deposit. Yeah, yeah but I hope she's okay. She's in labor. I have not sold anything today. You understand, Chris? You are my friend. I haven't sold anything today. So there's nothing I can do. Oh, okay, if, if you don't help me, I might lose my wife and child. I'm begging you in God's name. Look, 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 you are Chris. my last hope. You are my very good friend. I told you I haven't sold anything since today. So I won't lie to you. I'm telling you the truth. No matter what, no matter any amount you can raise for me. See, okay, Rebecca, take, I will, okay, take him inside. Okay, take, see, I, take him inside and show him. What you mean? Even, Dad. How did you know I'm watching you? Are you surprised? I saw you when you came out. What are you doing? I am playing. Oh. 
pastor, what kind of power are you talking about? Strange negative powers. It has been there right from my 